Hello boys and girls, it's your teacher, Miss Nahad. This week's book is called The Puddle Pail. So a puddle is like when it rains and there's water and you can jump in it and splash. So this is a puddle. So you, so you can stomp in there and have fun in a puddle after it rains. Um, puddles are created so it looks like this book has some dinosaurs like two dinosaurs and it's called the puddle pail the author is Elisa Clevin and she is also the illustrator so the author writes the words and the illustrator draws the pictures so we will read um, the puddle pail in a little bit, but before we read, what do we have to do? Vocabulary. Did you say vocabulary? Yes, vocabulary words. So let's do half and then the other half like we do every week, okay? All right, so first word for um, the puddle pail is called ordinary 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 so ordinary means plain not fancy just your basic so right here you have just an ordinary cupcake it has a little bit of frosting not any sprinkles not chocolate not little caramel nothing fancy it just has a cupcake with a little bit of frosting it's ordinary and on this side we have well, of course, probably fancy, but this word is ordinary. Can you say ordinary? Okay, ordinary. And then we have, ooh, look at this guy. What is he doing? Oh, ordinary starts with the letter O. And search, search starts with s, the letter S, search. So this guy is searching, looks like he's searching under the couch. What could he be searching for? Maybe his keys, maybe the remote, maybe some money, maybe, um, what else could he be searching for? Hmm. But probably the remote, keys, or some change that gets left in the couch. Search, search, he's searching for something. Search. Ooh, t, 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 the letter T, treasure, treasure. Ooh, there is a treasure under the ocean with lots of jewels and diamonds and pearls. Treasure. Or you know how I tell me tell you that you're my treasure, so I have to keep you nice and safe and take care of you. So this is treasure. Treasure. How about ooh, sparkly? S sparkly starts with the letter S. And look, it's nice and sparkly, really shiny, like the treasure. Sparkly. Sparkly. And then we have a collection with the letter C. Collection. 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 So you could start a collection of feathers or you could have a collection of all kinds of things like the little race cars you can have a collection of or Barbie dolls or like little things that you get at McDonald's or a collection of scarves, a collection of hats, a collection of shoes, a collection of coins. Just people decide to collect different things. So this is a collection of feathers, feathers. Maybe uh, some shells, seashells. When you go to the beach, you can collect some seashells and have different ones. All right.
right, and look at this little boy. Ooh, and he's holding some kind of a trophy. Maybe he had a t-ball game and they won the championship, or maybe he got all his words right in a spelling bee. Anyway, he looks very happy and pleased and proud. So the word is proud with the letter p, 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 proud, proud. I am so proud of you because you're learning your letters and your sounds and your numbers and your shapes and you log on to class and you come to class so your teacher is proud of you. Okay, proud. All right, boys and girls, so those are our first set of vocabulary words. I will come back with the other set and then we'll start to read the puddle pail. Teacher loves you.